Yeah, we're beauty's big sister. Check it. Uh. Hi, girls. Welcome back to my channel. Let's put this on silent. That didn't go to the best start already. <laughs> I've honestly tried to film this so many times. I was a hysterical mess <laughs> before filming it. I actually did get through filming it. Um, there's no way I can upload that footage. I'm just hysterical and you can't actually hear what the hell I'm saying. So I'm gonna try again. And I'm gonna try my hardest not to cry because that's not really the vibes you guys are wanting to see. Um, and I'm gonna try and look in the lens. I'm, I'm so out of practice. I'm looking at the finder rather than the lens. It's probably the weirdest position also that I'm filming in. But yeah, I'm sitting on the floor in front of my sofa rather than sitting on the sofa. <laughs> anyway, right, let's do this. Happy New Year. I'm sorry it's the end of Jan and it's not the beginning of Jan that I'm saying this. Um, and I have been off of YouTube for quite a while. Um, honestly, it's the hardest job in the world to do when life is uh, not going great. Uh, it's incredibly hard to pick up a camera and act like everything's fine. So I, I can't do that. I can't act like everything's fine because it hasn't been and it's not. But um, yeah, I don't want to portray that I've got this perfect life. I've always been like so honest with you guys um, and shared pretty much all my life. Life's not been too fun recently. Firstly, I hope you guys had a lovely Christmas and New Year. Um, and I hope you're having a really good start to th this new year. I've, I've seen online like so many people are actually going through really hard times at the minute. So if you are, I hope you're okay. Please, please speak to someone um, because I think honestly if i didn't have my friends and family around me i'd you know I'd, i don't even know because they have literally got me through um i don't know what i would have done without them i really really don't i don't even know how to film this without crying but um yeah it's just been a really hard end of last year and beginning of this year uh and everything quite unexpectedly so i think it's like the shock factor as well but i don't want this video to be really sad so I i'm just gonna you know go over things and then and then we can move forward with like a positive a positive start um but yeah in um december i lost my nan and it was very unexpected uh, with in terms of how quick it was um she went into hospital with heart failure and um caught the virus in there and then got sepsis and pneumonia um and didn't didn't make it so it's been awful and yeah as i said very very quick so it's been really hard to deal with that after my nan passing away since then Maya hasn't been with me. I can't even talk without crying, but at this point, she's such a huge part of what I share on social media. And I've had so many of you messaging concerned about her and where is she? Is she okay? So I know on the live stream, you girl, girls asked and um, I can't, you know, try to move forward without telling you because it's, uh, yeah, so hard when anyone asks but it's just been heartbreaking it's been horrendous i won't go into what has happened and i pray that she'll be back in my life one day but um she's not here she hasn't been here since the week before christmas so it's honestly been so painful i think for any pet owner you will know can understand just how heartbreaking um the thought of your baby being taken away let's have a cuppa that's always the answer <laughs> yeah you girls know how much Maya means to me and how much I love her so it's um been horrendous so yeah Christmas this year was really really difficult um without my nan without Maya um yeah a new day <laughs> I actually just couldn't carry on with filming 
yesterday I was just getting too upset so fridge is making noise we're coming back for a new day with little Leo bless him he's literally I can't tell you he's been my little savior <laughs> um, I thought I was gonna lose him at one point um, he was really really poorly um, but he's been amazing he's been a little trooper I took him to a specialist and he's actually completely fine um, they've done like various different things for him and he's now got a, a different diet but apart from that he's a happy little bunny and look at his squidgy little face <laughs> bless him it's just been really hard um, with my nan like it's like it comes in waves like I, I genuinely I think I still don't quite believe she's not here because it doesn't feel right um, and then with Maya I mean I'm just I just pray it's gonna work itself out in the end because I, I genuinely can't imagine this pain ever getting easier like it feels like it's getting harder the longer I haven't seen her um it just it physically I can't describe it it's like my heart physically hurts um I just miss her so incredibly much like I can't it's so hard to know how to deal with situations when you're online there's no right or wrong you know like I either just put on an act and act like the happiest person and that nothing's going on or I'm actually truthful and I, I, I can just be me you know like I, I physically can't put on an act at this point so I did film a video yesterday I tried to I'm gonna have to refilm it because I just <laughs> look miserable in it um, so yeah it's really been quite testing I, need, I just need to get back to things but yeah, please bear with me because um, obviously there was meant to be a video uploaded last night and I couldn't finish the video yesterday. <laughs> I, um, I, I just struggled too much. I actually edited it and everything and was just going to put it up but it, it, literally there was no ending to it. So. Um, yeah, I went around my friends last night which was really nice and the girls have been here today which has been lovely. So it's really nice to have people around me at the minute because I feel like I, I do struggle when I'm on my own. The mornings are always hard at the minute because it's so frustrating. I wish I could switch off my thoughts because I dream about the situation every night. So then I wake up and I'm instantly upset. Um, I wish there was a way of switching off your brain, but um, I will get there in time. Um, I've just got, got to just keep pushing myself because I, you know, I can't mope about all day, every day, hugging Maya's toys. Been sorting out my blog about this afternoon and, and opening things, going through everything, and I've been sent this from Robbie Brown, so I thought I'd make my smoothie with you. They've sent, how cool is this? Oh. oh, why am I this clumsy? Stabbed my finger, or maybe it hasn't pierced the skin. I mean, it hurt, but I don't think we're drawing blood, so that's good. <laughs> Bobby Brown blender. Um, we've got all the ingredients. I've even got a Bobby Brown grapefruit. Like, that's pretty cool. Um, we've got, I always say chia seeds, but it's not, is it? Is it? What is it? I always get confused with these words. An acai, but it's acai, isn't it? I don't know. Um, shea butter powder, multi-vitamin powder, and sweet argive. Um, we do have in here oat milk. Oh no, that's leaking. Not ideal. Um, but this hasn't been in the fridge. So I think I'm actually just gonna use my normal milk. But this is all to celebrate their face cream. Have you tried this? It's so good. I actually put, like, I mean, this is the hugest tub, it's 100 mil. I've got a tub of this um, on my dressing table next to my makeup because I really, really, really like this. 
more like a, a moisturizer slash primer like underneath makeup is really really nice it does say it hydrates primes and enhances makeup in one step with the best selling vitamin enriched face base they actually sell one of these every 24 seconds that's literally insane um so there's hyaluronic in here shea butter vitamin b5 c and e vitamin rich face base hydrates softens and smooth skin um and it's got a grapefruit scent which is why we've got the grapefruit for the smoothie um so they do do it how cute is this it's gonna be so handy for traveling a cute little mini one so this is a 15 mil and then they also have it in a 50 mil as well um but yeah if you haven't tried it it is a really really gorgeous um nice light day cream i really like it in the summer actually ah, it doesn't fit oh yeah it does can't get it to turn on well this is off to a great start why won't it turn on like no joke this sounds like it's going to explode it just keeps on making noises when i open this it's going to explode i'm a little bit scared oh <laughs> but <laughs> anti-climax <laughs> oh my whoa 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 it's like rising got it we are good <laughs> do i try and do a reel i really need to get better at doing reels so maybe i should try and film some insta content <laughs> how cool is this you just charge it here and then you could just smoothie out and about like you just literally press this button and off it goes it's also so much quieter than the um nutribullet very very handy and then you just unscrew this well and then i can drink it from here let me let me see what it tastes like i don't actually like the taste of grapefruit it's quite grapefruity i'm not gonna lie but i am gonna try and drink it because it'll be good for my uh skin my body needs some goodness in me right now um i might actually put it in the, the fridge so it's nice and cold maybe i should blend it with some ice that might be nice yeah so it's just been you know quite a hard start to this year but by looking online i have seen so many other people going through a hard time um at the minute like i, I feel like on top of january already just not being great it's not a great time of year um, there just seems to be like quite a lot going on in everyone's life at the minute so if you are going through a hard time i'm honestly sending so much love to you we will get through this together um but please do speak to the people around you i yeah as i said i genuinely don't know how i would have got through this time without my friends and family they have literally pulled me through when i've been just yeah so so low so um hopefully you know, I, I feel like if you get down here, the only way is to go up. Don't feel like I can go a floor lower. So if I can get on the elevator now to go back up, that would be great. <laughs> I think reading is definitely helping me at the minute. I'm reading my, my books, um, the Vex King book I'm actually reading, um, and listening to podcasts. I really feel that helps me. Like uh, It's been quite stressful with Serena Day's. You know, you, you have to invest so much money and it is scary and it's a rubbish time of the year financially, you know, with the tax return, the dreaded tax return, um, with work being so quiet, uh, you know, it is, it's quite scary. But listening to podcasts really, really does help me um, stay, you know, as positive as can be. It helps put you in a positive mindset. So I would definitely recommend find the right podcast for you. I've actually been listening to Stephen Bartlett's one, which I find really, really helpful and useful. So I'm just trying to feed my soul with positive things and surround myself with positive people um, to try and get me where I need to be. Um, but I am excited for this year. I think that last year was a tough one for me. So I'm hoping that this year, you know, I'm turning 30, I'm hoping that it's it's going to come together and um, it's going to be a positive year. I, I feel confident that it will be. So I just need to try and look forward. Um, and yeah, literally at the minute, I'm just taking each day as it comes, but we will get there in time. I am so, so lucky and blessed to have 
the nicest group of girls in my community online so thank you i am so lucky to have such a nice group of girls around me so I, I really appreciate all your lovely messages and support like just checking in on me on the days where I, I went AWOL didn't didn't show up on social media you guys were checking in so thank you if there are any particular videos you want me to film um about literally anything please do let me know in the comments below because I feel like I need to maybe do longer videos maybe more vlog style is what you want to see so let me know if you do in the comments and also I'm gonna alternate between YouTube live and Instagram live so this Monday coming will be an Instagram live so I'll remind you on social media <laughs> on Instagram which um, Monday it will be so alternating between YouTube and Instagram but I will remind you on a Monday where we'll be uh, but yeah I'm sending you so much love thank you for everything and I will see you in my next video bye Never like the glue on the lashes I'm flea like the brows Never throwing in a towel Always ready for the town Looking beautiful together You're stronger than ever Your community don't tether Yeah, your sisters forever Girls before you missed her Be part of a team Yeah, we're beauty's big sister It's said And put your girls before you missed her Be part of a team Yeah, we're beauty's big sister Check it